What's up guys, Backyard Painter here. This is gonna be my first video. And first thing I wanna do is show you guys around the setup that I have in my backyard. So this is my tent that I bought at Harbor Freight. It's a what? It's a 10 by 17, um, just a regular canopy just a tent. Just an enclosed, enclosed tent. This is a 10 by 17 enclosed tent. As you can see, we, we wired some LED strips on here. They're pretty bright. Might need to do better. Might do more strips on the sides or something like that or more powerful LEDs. But as you can see here, we got two high velocity fans, one sucking in, and we also have an AC unit that's blowing because when it's hot, humid, it helps out a lot. So that one's sucking in and this one's sucking out. And we use these, uh, and we are using these HVAC. HVAC filters from Home Depot, 16 by 16. We're probably gonna get some paint booth filters because uh, they don't block that very well. But we got that set up right there and that one right there. They do pretty well for now. As you can see, I, I just finished painting this car right here, 2017 WRX. Just check out the paint. It's pretty good. There's a few bits of trash here and there, but what do you expect from a backyard paint job in the tent? But as you can tell, a piece of trash there. There's like very minimal trash, but we are gonna after this we're gonna buff this whole entire side and maybe just the whole car because uh oem paint is kind of scratched up can't really tell but it is it has swirls everywhere but that's what you get from a from a makeshift paint booth it's not that hard to build fairly cheap compared to uh, compared to other paint booths and uh you'll save a lot of money a lot of money painting yourself and whatnot but there you go guys stay tuned i'm gonna have more and better videos coming out here in the future tell y'all how to mix your paint how to spray your paint how to clear coat how to blend how to base coat yeah we did blend this on this fender because this door was white we blended it and we blended on this quarter panel from this door so it's looking great it's still drying we gave it about two hours of dry time we're in here we just untaped it so stay tuned, like, and subscribe, and uh, just be on the lookout. I'm going to be giving y'all a bunch of valuable information if you want to do some paint jobs in your backyard or at your house, in your driveway. Just stay tuned, and I'll give y'all tips and tricks on how to do that and the setup of my paint booth. I'll give y'all a more in-depth view and tour of it if you want. Comment below, and uh, we'll catch you next time. Peace.